Greetings everyone and welcome back to Rail Routes. In today's video we continue with where we left off. Now last episode wasn't super productive due to the learning more about the intercity trains and how they interact with the coach yards. So between episodes I spent a little bit of time trying to figure out if there's any ways to turn around trains automatically without using another platform and from what I tested I couldn't find a way. There might be a way which I didn't think of but in order to deal with this, I I have re removed all contracts that go to Masurik Station between episodes, including the commuter trains that we accepted. Now, just just whilst I was testing it and whatnot, just to, just to get him out of my way. From what I've learned, I don't think I'm going to be doing intercity trains, and we're going to purely just do commuter trains through Davis, Bobney, Masurik, and back and from Visasani to Masaryk Station and back. That's going to be the aim. So, But when I was testing, I built up a collection of contracts for us to do this episode. And what we can do is we can start accepting some of them. Although, you may have noticed, I did change the layout down here, and I will maybe explain that a little later. But the basic idea is all trains coming in and then going to the coach yard are going to be on these top two platforms. Whilst well, so the trains that are coming from the coach yard and then leaving are going to these bottom two platforms, okay? And I've made it so we've avoided any crossovers, really. So hopefully that should run quite smoothly. Because we're going to have a lot of trains going in and out of this station. So we want them to be sort of as separated as possible. So let's get started. We're going to accept that on four. And then hopefully this knows where, it's, where to tend it. And... We're going to get over to here and we're going to want to send it up. Uh, Bruising sensor. Yes, we're going to just want to send that one. Like so. Has it not picked up this? That's meant to be like that. So I've obviously forgotten something there. Like so. Now, I wanted to time how long it takes for a train to get to here. Now, this is very important based on when we want to start bringing trains in and out because coach yards don't have any internal signals in essence so they will just dispatch trains whenever you tell them to or have them automatically do it so i just want to know exactly when it gets in there okay so it does it at just over a, sorry just under just over a minute that's a very awkward amount of time and I, but i don't know if there's any way we can make this shorter here Okay, we're gonna have to we'll have to experiment with it, but we're gonna have to be careful when we experiment with it because it's a very it's a very dangerous game considering because we can have trains be crashing quite easily. So if we say from coach yard, when we configure this, we're gonna say automatically do commuters. And we're gonna go with well, let's see how long it takes. So it's about 12, 24. It should know. Actually, it won't know where to go just yet. So we'll we'll tell it to go there. Twenty-four twelve. Yeah, we'll give them two minutes. I think that's fair. And then this should be able to work its way all the way out to the edge of the map. Okay, we'll just speed it up. Oh, why is this one? Oh, I never never inputted stuff into this. Okay. Right, let me just quickly do that and I'll be back. Okay, so that's that all done. And let's... Oh, it won't know where to go here either because of the arrival sensor. And there we go, into Visasani. Like so, and... So how long does it take? It's calculating five minutes at the moment. And it's... But it might, we can maybe do it a minute quicker depending on this auto signal here. So we'll mess around. I'll adjust all the times a little later. I want to get a few more accepted because I want to try and just get a small handful of trains in a very short amount of time all fully optimised in here. So we'll do a Devise one this time uh, on platform three. Now hopefully this should all be okay. So it leaves at 35. Oh yeah, I need to just tell it if it's going to Masaryk Station, go via 
there. That's my fault. So we'll have a look and I'll see how long it takes because... Oh, an arrival sensor, yep. Yeah. So it left at 35. So two minutes is fair. I think two minutes is fair. Uh, so let me just write this down before we move on. So when it comes to adjusting the trains. Now it should know where to go now. However, what platform did I send the other one to? Platform three. So this time we're gonna send this to platform one. It's going to come through this one, so we're going to send it to platform one, like so. Oh, what's this? Oh, this just needs to be, this just needs to be like this. So I obviously haven't tested this network, so there might be little gaps in in it like that. And then that should all be done. We can definitely make that quicker, but I'm not too, too not too bothered about the, the speeds and stuff at the moment. Um, we've got a Masaryk station to Devise. I like that one. This one's going to go on to... So we had the other one go on to platform 2, so we want this one to go on to platform 4. Yeah, that should all be good. Uh, it should know where to go to for Devise. Over here, we're going to have to just... Okay, yep. Yeah. I need to be careful of that. So, it left... When did it leave? It left at 48. And there's been no slowdown so far, so... We could say two minutes. Yeah, let me just write that down. Uh, so we're going to go from Maseric Station to Bobney and we're going to say two minutes. So we say two minutes for that and then when's it planned to leave here? 52. It won't know where to go at Devise. Although, is it on... It can only go to Platform 4 so we might as well just set that as default. That way I don't need to do that for all of these commuter trains that we're going to be accepting. So when did it leave? It left at 52. I guess we could leave it two minutes on there as well. Let's see what reward it gives us first. Yeah, so we need to definitely improve that. Okay, so... I wanted to go and try and adjust some stuff then, so... We've going from... Right, let's just bring it all in. Actually, first we can adjust the time, so Devise to Bobney. Devise to Bobney, I like the two minutes. I think this can maybe done, be done by one. But it was even faster. How? <laughs> okay, I'm going to mess around with that a bit later. But first I want to actually see if we can get them. So if it's coming out two minutes early... Alright, it's going to take a bit of thinking. If we're saying the train comes out two minutes early, it's going to come out here. I mean, I think that works. But then what's this one here? This is the... But it's going to be around that minute mark, so two minutes. Right, let's see how that behaves. Uh, how long till we're there? Okay, so I might as well just accept some more in that in that meantime. Um, yeah, we'll go for this one. On platform four.
Uh, and then what I can say is I can say default platform here is free. And default platform for this one is one. Like so. And hopefully it should know where to go now. And yes, it does. Now, I really do want to watch this because... It's 50 there. It's so close to being good. It's just not quite there. Okay, that's all right. Let's just accept more because we need to really uh, from Coach Yard. And what platform does this one need to go to? Uh, this is going to so platform platform two, wasn't it? Yeah, platform two. Like so, and then it should know where to go from there onwards, apart from there. So, when did it leave? It left at seven past. And uh, what time will it get in here? Yeah, I think that's fair. So, it says four minutes. Four minutes is a fair amount, I would say. Now, when's this next stuff coming out? Station two. Don't need that. I need to, this one will do. Accept it on three. Now, it should be all good. Oh, where's that arrival? Then that should know where to go, hopefully. Apparently not. I'm not sure why. Okay, we'll leave it like that and we'll figure that one out. Not sure about that. Let's just keep these going. Ah. This is going to be a slight issue. <laughs> what platform does this one need to go to? Platform... One. I mean, it might not be terrible. Oh, they're on the exact same minute, though. That's an issue. <laughs> okay, that's a slight issue. I'll have to adjust all this later. Because we're going to have something come out two minutes before, right? When's this one due? No, how have you run that? Okay, well, it actually works out okay. So that has waited for it to come out. Honestly, this game amazes me every day. I'm... <laughs> Okay, I'm going to need to go through and adjust all. So, let me... Which one is it? Is it... It's this one. Adjust timetable. Massively. But, it's two minutes to there. I think three minutes to there is fair. But how much have I got on the contract? Three... How fast do they expect me to make these? What if I did that? Do we think they can do it in one minute from Bubney? I mean, we're going to see, aren't we? I 
Okay, so there is some waiting. I thought the coach yards were a bit more brutal, but apparently not. Let me go here. Okay, we've got so much to fiddle around with here. I've got two of each now, which is what I wanted, because I'm going to try and put them all together and just replicate... Oh, no. I don't want you going there. Just replicate a small part of... So what? what is this? Rooting. If it picks up... Def I'm getting rid of this for now, because it's causing issues. Uh, default platform four for now, I guess. I need to try and figure that out, but that's the least of my worries at the moment. I'm trying to just make sure all of this is okay. So, what have we got? We've got this, and I'm going to say, so if we have that one there, let me bring that one in there. And we can bring that back one, I reckon. Yeah, because it's going to go, it's going to be getting to the coach about a minute in. And this is. T Let me just adjust. Actually, I think before I make many of these adjustments. Actually, let me just. Uh, I don't know if I've got enough in the coach at the moment. Before I make too many of these adjustments, I would like to. Make sure these times are all good. Because they're not... We're going to, to do some very, very precise... I need the picture. Where is it? Uh, I need to make some very... And then this can be like... There, I guess. I mean, actually, we could make it maybe a bit further in. What if I did it there? Yeah, I'll do it there for now. Uh, what I needed to do was I need to measure some of these speeds of these trains. However, I haven't got any at hand at the moment. So, so we're saying four minutes from here. Let's see. What are these four minutes, and that's maximal value? Uh, where's the other one? That's on five minutes, and it's at max. But we know it can be done faster, so we'll just. Adjust that. So I know for certain, or pr pretty well, that between Visasani and Maserik Station, we can do it in around uh, four minutes. So let's. So they should be okay. Maserik Station to Podbaba. I'm not going to be doing those. I don't want Podbaba. Davis to. That was something else I wanted to do this. Potentially this episode. Uh, let's just uh, let's accept enough one of these. Why not? We want it on platform four. And it should know where it's going. I should hope. And then we see how fast this one does it. So we're aiming for 47. Like... Yeah, see, that's a 47 is pretty fair. I'm happy with that. And then... Yep, yeah, so that's getting four minutes already. Then if we do... We'll do this one from Coach Yard. The Visosani ones are on platform... Two. Let me just... Uh, four is Davis. Is it? I'm guessing it's one is Davis. Three is this. So I'm just writing this down so I don't have to keep looking back here every time. So this one's going to two. Like so. Let that turn around and then hopefully it does it in 52. So that's a little of an issue by the looks of things, but again, it's not its not going to be very easy to adjust that, and then we'll send that there. And that should take about four minutes. 
I think it did, so. Uh, yep, that's... And so it's averaging speeds of 90, which gives us a good idea of which contracts we can maximise. So any above 90, it looks like we won't be able to do. Uh, this one's... They're all on fours, so they're okay. It's these ones over here that I need to pay attention to. Let me adjust the time. So this is on the very, very tight timetable. I want to see if it can actually do it. This is the ideal timetable on what we want them to be on. However, I don't know how doable it is. So uh, let me just speed it up a bit. Uh, I also... Actually, it's not, not yet, not the bit we've adjusted. I want to see how that performs. A minute is fair, a minute is fair. And we said two minutes for this bit. Two minutes might be a little tight. Unless we adjusted this bit somehow to make it so it has to go less out of its way. Right, okay, so it comes out now. That's fine. Maybe I'll quickly look into this. Um, so what I wanted to do was see if we can do something here. And we're going to go... It's like, what if I did that? How would I do this bit though? Unless I had like another tunnel. But then again, I can't put a sensor there, can I? I need it to be one longer. Unless I'm going to. Oh, I'm doing a bit of an overhaul here, guys. Uh, I hope it pays off. <laughs> uh, what I want to do is I want to do that. That. That way. I can do this, I do that, then if I go here, I can remove that, we can remove it all the way up to there, probably, like so, we just change those track speeds, and then an arrival sensor there, if we send it to that one, and there, and Like so. Maybe what I'll do is I'm going to move that auto signal forward actually. And then that's going to have issues. We can fix that. Then this. Station cannot be. Oh, I see. It's meant to be that one. Oh, and I need a routing sensor, don't I? Oh, but I can put a routing sensor on the same. You can put routing sensors on the same block as that, which is very useful. And we're going to select that one, and we're going to just say all of them go to there. And then the arrival sensor will deal with this signal here as wanted. And then that to there. Perfect. And then this, I need a routing sensor around there. And we're going to say there, and others to there, and then... I think that should all be fixed. Well, we've got this empty space here, which we're not using anymore, by looks of things. Let's see if this one survives. It. I don't think I'd really changed anything about this bit, so we should be okay. Okay, uh, oh, is this, what, what's this timetable? Okay, well, we can watch it anyway. I've, I've timetabled it for two minutes here anyway. That's the bit I'm most interested in. To be honest, I'm most interested in all of this section. So that's the one that's due. What's this one on? Oh, that's on... F that's not... Okay. Found another one that needs adjusting. So that's going through there. When's this one due? 
I want to know... When's this one due? 23. Oh. Does it not pick up the routines? Oh, does it only pick up one and not the other? Oh, yeah. Right, okay. So that's... That's there. It would have been a bit quicker. Delay one minute. Yeah, okay. Not surprised. Okay, so it's worked fairly smoothly. I need to change this because clearly I can't... I believe how it works actually is the routing sensor is a, is a hierarchy in which one it picks up and it doesn't pick up both. I didn't want to get the arrival sensor, but... So the arrival sensor is for this one, for that one, and the routing sensor is for this one and others to this little bit and then send that to green through there. Okay, it looks like a bit of a nightmare at the moment. But I think we're getting somewhere. Now, which one? This one. Uh, no, no, no. Uh, I wanted this one. If we do that, because then it won't mess up how I've got it set up here, because this actually works quite well, I think. So, yeah, sorry this video is getting a bit long, but what I'll do is get that sorted. And then I'm going to merge them all up, and then we're going to see how it performs, and we'll probably end it there. So, bring it closer at least. Um, Why can't I shift it all anymore? Oh, I see. Yeah, that would take it too far back in time. How do I want it here? I want it so it lies one minute here. One minute. Uh, oh, no, one more. One minute gap like that. And then this one. Oh, but I need to edit and make sure they're all the correct, like, times. This one. We, that's the ambitious one, which we're going to stick with. And we've allowed four minutes for that. That's perfect. This one. Well, let me move this one first, actually. And we want it a one minute overlap there. So this one could be brought forward one minute. And then we haven't got any more going to Devise by the looks of things, but we'll see how this performs. Ah, what I want to keep my eye on is actually this one here, uh, mainly. Because this is the one that's we've really been pushing the time limit with. So it needs to be there by f 34. It's going to be tight, but I think it. what I've done might have helped it so we haven't got delays. And it's less risk of 34. Yeah, this is actually pretty good. So that one's going to come out like that. This one's leaving on time. This one's going to go round to the coach yard. This one's coming down here. And then this one should go to the coach yard shortly. Ah, uh, it looks like we've got a delay here, though. We've got a delay in the arrival and departure of this one. Then again, it's not a major delay, because this is only due here to be at 36. So I might just leave it how it is, because... At the moment... That's not an issue. However, it would be nice to avoid that, so what would be an alternative way of doing it? Uh, if we had, so let's have a look at this. So we're saying the issue is this one arrives as this one leaves. So what we're saying we should do is we should swap this with this, I believe. 
because the crossover's here. So as this one's leaving, we can have this one turn up on this platform. So that might be better. It's all about trial and error here and just improving based on each iteration, I think. So we'll let it run and then I want to try and merge it all up together. Although I really need to get another, is it another Davi, Maseric to Davi, yeah, I believe so. So let's accept that and we want it from Coachard. And this one's going to Davi, so we want it to go to platform four, like so. And then that can go on its way. This bit I'm going to have to... Um, let me see what it reads. I want to know what it, where it sends it. If anywhere. What I'll do is I'll do this and then I can see if it picks up anything else. This might be one of these issues where I need to put the routing sensor separate. Because it, it picks up, it's going to the V. Oh, because this is the trial run. I'm being silly. No. Ignore me. <laughs> and then the rest should be okay, I believe. Two minutes, we can make that one minute, and that can maybe be two minutes. So before we do anything more, we're going to adjust all these, but first I want to go through and sort of check and see if they're all okay. So four minutes uh, for these ones, yeah. Yeah, they're all good. Oh, and then these ones should also be four minutes. Yeah, they're all perfect. Then these ones, we're saying one, two, one, two, and then this one, we're going to go with two, one, like so. Which one was that? So uh, we got. Masaryk to Bubney can be done in two, I reckon. We're going to put it like that for now. And then if it's a major issue, we'll, we'll change it. And then what else have we got? So, so that is two, one, two, one. Perfect. This one is one, two, Two, uh, it's two, two. So we want that to be a one, two. Perfect. Okay, now we're just going to let it run a little bit more and then I'm going to adjust this timetable and merge it all together. And hopefully, so this is the bit that we're happy with, I believe. Well, it's the modified one. I'm hoping we don't have any issues with it. If we can run this successfully, then we can run the whole hour successfully. That's what this amounts to. So let's see what happens, I guess. I will probably cut back when we get to that bit as this... Yeah, I'll be back shortly. So the trains are going to be coming through just shortly. First one comes through Devise here. Just going to keep an eye on it and see if the minutes on it are fair, fair enough. So it's through there at 19, but we've got uh, 24 seconds, that's okay. And then we've got the next one coming through already. We've got one from, uh, what's it, Vissasani coming through, and another one. This is the bit where we're going to have to keep a good eye on. So this one's going to go through first, hopefully get out of the way. Like so, the one's going to come out of the coach yard, like so. 
This one sits there for a minute. This one's going to go in. This one's going to come out first. Like so. That one's going to go in. We should have another one come out. No more coming out yet? Okay. And another one comes out. This one goes through. And then that one's got to go round to here. And that one's going to come out. That one goes there. This one's due for this. Oh no, we haven't got anything due on platform one. This one's going to go all the way through to platform three. Okay, what I can conclude from this is I don't think the coach yards are as brutal as I re remember them being, because I remember they used to be quite quite challenging. Unless there were any changes made, or whether I was just not doing it correctly the last time I was... Not in this series, but in another time before the series I was playing. But it all looks good. I want to just see how these commuter trains just do with their times. Look, um... 30. That does it quite well. Two minutes to there is actually very fair because it will leave on time. So I'm happy with that. And then Stu at Davies for 32. Which it also does in a very fair time. So M Maseric to Davies I'm very happy with. I think Davies to Maseric is a bit a bit iffy. But it it's doable. Okay, I think that's the best way to describe it. With that all being said, though, I reckon I should probably end the episode here. We've actually been quite productive, and we've finally got a good schedule to work with for this station, Masaryk Station. So next episode, I'm just going to go full on, lots of contracts. We're going to fill up this timetable. This is going to become a solid block of just trains. We'll hopefully get that all sorted. And then after that, we, I might do one more video where I just kind of discuss the game a bit and do more contracts, etc. Because I need to adjust up here. And then I will get to this big expansion down here, the long and awaited expansion. Yeah, with that all being said, though, uh, if you have enjoyed, please leave a like and subscribe. And I'll catch you all in the next one.